No need for these teams to suss out who's who or to assess the likely formations. It's the third time in a month that Arsenal have met Bristol Academy. Fishlock almost on the goal line. It's a really good opportunity for Bristol ladies. The threat is there from Gemma Rose. Howe looking for fleeting. He just lost a footing. Chance now for Arsenal, and it's one that's been brilliantly taken. A fantastic goal by Kim Little. I think it has been coming. You know, you, you can see Kim Little's been on the ball quite a lot. She's been, you know, getting free kicks, but, you know, a little nutmegs there. And to have this sort of composure to just knock it past the player and just nice little side foot into the corner. It was coming, and, you know, Bristol have to get their heads up now and, and start start believing in themselves and getting forward a little bit more, but Kim Little, you know, I think we mentioned there is a key player. Stopped by Birmingham in their opening fixture, one that they lost 4-0, but since then defensively they've really tightened up. A goal is draw against Everton, another goal is draw against Chelsea. Oh, he's thrown it off the top of the crossbar. It was Fleeting's effort and Chamberlain was beaten. And a real let-off for Bristol Academy. Here's Little. Ellen White, magnificent save by Chamberlain. Or Chamberlain, who had a degree of good fortune as well when the initial effort came back off the crossbar. But she's been beaten this time. Julie Fleeting thundering in to get Arsenal second. It was a magnificent ball in. Bristol Academy have been reeling a little bit and they've been pulled apart here. And Arsenal ladies have got their second through Julie Fleeting. That's a fantastic cross. It's exactly where a centre forward would want the ball to go. And Julie Fleeting is not going to miss from there. You know, what a header. She's an absolute poacher, scores so many goals for club and country. In by Yankee. Met by Fleeting. The delivery's been spot on. You know, from Rachel Yankee, from, from Kin Little on the other side. Yankee. It's come right the way through here to Little. Chamberlain makes the save. You know, just playing Rachel into the into the space, and like you say, with her pace, she can she can get forward, and that's a, a nice ball. Julie Fleeting misses the ball, but Kim Little's there to, to sort of pick up the rebounds, if you like. Who's it to be, Blizzard or Yorston? I think I'm going for Corinne Yorston. Then the goalkeeper has got plenty of protection. It's Blizzard. Oh. It's a magnificent effort. I think Emma was completely beaten there. Just got... Just hit the crossbar, but... They've got to, they've got to take confidence from this now, you know. Well, they played rugby for the British Lions. Done by Beatty. It's a magnificent save by Chamberlain to keep out Little. It was a really nice diagonal ball. I think it was Steph Horton. She rose well. And a fantastic save from Siobhan. But that would have been a, a great introduction. You know, first touch set up Kim Little and. Yeah, yeah, Arsenal ladies have won the. FA Women's Cup of 2011, two first half goals, enough in the end, the first by Kim Little, the second by Julie Fleeting, Arsenal have their hands on the trophy yet again, it's finished, Arsenal ladies two, Bristol Academy now. The FA Women's Cup winners of 2011, it's Arsenal ladies.